this video we will show the insertion of an AVX IDC single contact using both hand tooling and a cap. When using the hand tooling the following procedure should be used. Support the PCB underneath to prevent damage to the PCB during assembly. Pre-prepare the cable by cutting to the length required if necessary. Place the tool on the top of the connector, ensuring that the tool is in the correct position. Push home the tool until it reaches the top of the connector. Ensure the tooling stays perpendicular to the PCB throughout the process. Remove the tool and ensure the wire is completely down in the connector slot. The connection is complete. When using the cap for insertion, the following procedure should be used. Set the press height to adjust below the connector mated height. See the product drawing for the required dimension. Support the PCB underneath the connector to prevent damage to the PCB during assembly. Pre-prepare the cable by cutting to the length required if necessary. Place the wire into the cap as shown. Place the cap on top of the connector, ensuring that the cap is in the correct position. Pull the press down to the stop, ensuring the cap is clipped into place. A slower press speed is ideal to allow the wire to correctly align. Open the tool and remove the PCB. The connection is complete. For 9176400 series connectors, a force of approximately 175 newtons per wire is required. For 9176500 series connectors, a force of approximately 225 newtons per wire is required. The actual forces depend on the wire type and the size being used. For more information, refer to the product application notes.